the Rust node is supposed to be like a Caspa full node with better performance, right? So, so think about it like this. We want the Rust node to first, to first be able to function properly in a network of Go nodes, of current nodes. The implementation doesn't matter. It, ha it has the same network interfaces and it interacts with all the current network nodes. So the first thing we want before using it to outperform, we want it to function like them first and without errors, without, without mistakes. And then once it stabilizes, we can run an, a network only with these. And since they can reach better performance, uh, once we have the network only with these Rust nodes, we, we will be able to increase all kinds of parameters and make it more fast, uh, increase BPS and stuff like that. So the handshake is simply the logic of, of speaking between nodes on the peer-to-peer -peer network. Uh, and the first thing is, is taking this Rust node and handshaking it with the previous Go node. Likewise, this Rust node can handshake another new Rust node. The idea is it's the first communication step between uh, of this node with other nodes, specifically now with the Go node.